back on Zebra 96 back here for the special another special review. Um and after this it's probably gonna be depending <coughs> <coughs> depending on money and stuff. I don't know if I'll be doing more reviews. We'll see. Um anyway. Uh so um so yeah, um I wanted to go ahead and do this review, get it knocked out of the way, because why not? Um Yeah, um I sh I didn't shit I took a shower last night, got drunk as all get out. Uh, so girls at work, she gets off at ten tonight and we're planning on drinking tonight because she's off tomorrow. So we're probably going to drink tonight, depending. I don't know. We haven't got that far yet. I'm just... Technically, I'm just waiting for her. So what are we reviewing today? Outlaw. Cowmore Apple. Um, It is tobacco-free, but it has nicotine. So, yeah. And it says right here on the side, 100%. And stuff like that. Let me line the ten up real quick. Yeah, this is tobacco free. One hundred percent tobacco free. So if you got your dip, grab your dip. If you got your chew, grab your chew. If you don't dip, thumbs up to you. Thank you for coming back to the channel. I know some of y'all don't dip, and that's all right by me, because I'm by myself. So that's why I say me instead of us. So yeah, I'll, uh, real quick before we get any further, I want to talk about the can before we pack a dip. So look at the can. I see the apple in the back, and then the orange is like, I guess, representing car caramel. That's a pretty cool can. Side, got the Outlaw logo, got Camel Apple, got the warning label, like the warning label, Outlaw, that, the barcode, and then back to that. So, yeah, and the bag has nothing on it. So, yeah, uh, so let's, let's get a dip. Let's shut up and get a dip. I just had Copenhagen Wintergreen in, but I took it out because I wanted to do this review. It's not much left, but it's it's enough for a, a decent size pinch and a review. It smells like app. It smells like a sweet red apple and some caramel mixed into it. I can't really smell the caramel as much as the apple, but that's just me. Um. So yeah. If you look at the lighting, my eyes are look bluer than normal. It's just the lighting. We ha we have our window open and the sun's coming in. Try to save electricity. So let's shut up and get a dip. And that's a decent sized auger. I'll probably add some to it. Even though I just let some foul. I let some fall, okay. I'll clean it up in a little bit. So anyway. Um not sponsored, but my drug of the day is a McDonald's cup. Just the waxness of it. Just it's just it's waxy and stuff. So it's just it's not it's not the same as actual dip. No, okay. I just I didn't know. That's why. A little pillow fella. So let that soak for a minute. Or however you want to say it so um yeah uh yesterday I um I walked with Mike and Amanda to uh, a few places DG the bank and stuff like that 
And then yesterday, I don't know why my throat is acting like this. <coughs> then yesterday, I walked to Sheets and I got food, chips, Dr. Pepper, and a case of Pepsi, a 12 pack of Pepsi. Dr. Pepper's for her, Pepsi is for me. And so, um, yeah. Doesn't taste like I, I I can't tell any taste with this, tell you the truth. But I mean, then again, the formula could be different. Then you know, if you made one batch and then changed it after that and stuff like that. But I can't really, I can't pinpoint taste and you spit black so that ain't bad at all I got hair I need to shave I like for real I need to shave again I have not shaved since being up here and uh, April 30th will be tomorrow actually makes one month of me being here so, yeah, um, got a decent shot to dip in, but, um, yeah, I can't tell, I can just taste nothing but wax, and it could just be, um, the fact of it being, um, I'm used to actual dip and not this, so that could be the case, I mean, I don't know. Don't ask. I was trying to get some more flavor out of it. But other than that, um, if you think you wouldn't want to try it, get it. I would never get I will never buy it again. The taste don't taste right to me. Um, that's why after I got the bourbon, the Lucky Lipper, I stopped doing it. I stopped. I didn't even want to buy it again because... The taste don't taste right to me. Because remember, I tried it on his first batch of the watermelon. And I could actually taste watermelon from that. So, but, um, this is just gonna end the video, I guess. Um, so yeah. If you ain't dipping your trip and keep track, keep track. I hope to see you on the dip side. Stay positive, always think positive, and never think negative, and never things will come your way. Always think and stay positive and positive things will come in your direction. I hope you have a great day, great night, wherever you're watching this. If I don't see you, I'll see you on the dip side. America.